to describe the external abdominal oblique. I have drawn the posterior pelvis and spine with ribs five through 12, and an anterior pelvis linea alba and the costal cartilage of ribs five through 12. The origin of the, trans the external abdominal oblique are the muscular slips of ribs five through 12. You'll see them starting posteriorly on the ribs and they'll move around the trunk anteriorly. The insertion is the iliac crest, the ASIS, pubic tubercle, and the linea alba. So the muscle will run from the muscular slips around to the posterior side to insert on these locations. For another visual, here is a model from the Complete Anatomy app. The innervation is the ventral rami T7 through 12. The blood supply are the medial branches of the musculophrenic artery, the superficial epigastric artery, and the superficial circumflex artery. The actions for the external abdominal oblique bilaterally are to compress the abdominal viscera, aid in expiration, and trunk flexion. Unilaterally, this muscle will do ipsilateral side bending and contralateral rotation. Closed chain, it will do posterior pelvic tilt. So if your trunk is anchored and your pelvis is free, it will tilt the pelvis posteriorly.